Well done, Tom. That was a pretty exciting finish to 2013 Jewel in the Pool. And a good night for you. How was that? I mean, it was really fun. It was really cool to watch um, Eugene and, um, oh my gosh, who was that? Kevin and Claire and Simone just pulled out at the end there. That was a really, really fun relay. For you personally, it's been a great meet as well. Short course seems to be your, your real comfort zone as well. Is that fair to say? Yeah, very, very true. Um, I spent some good time this year um, going to the World Cups. I went to seven of them. So the short course meters has kind of been a home for me. Um, the international swimming scene has uh, growing on me. So I, I really, really like it. But I do want to push it over to the long course champs eventually, you know, like everyone else does. So I'm in a really important race today, the men's 4x100 freestyle. And you're absolutely nailing your turns. That was probably one of the reasons that the Americans won, do you think? Um, you know, I wasn't really paying attention to the, um, you know, the overall um, I mean, obviously the points I was, but like, you know, where we were in the race or anything, I, all I knew is that like, okay, um, Tony's last 25, I was like, okay, it's going to be pretty close. Like, I didn't, I'm going to need to race this guy pretty hard. And so I don't know where we won per se, but I just did my best. What was it like with the atmosphere out there? I think the crowd was quite supportive oh of both teams. It was one of the funnest meets I've ever been at. Um, to do a dual meet like this, but to do it in a championship format is really, really fun. And uh, I was just so thankful that I got the nod um, to be invited to this meet. Um, it was just you know, the most fun I've ever had on a national team trip, the most fun I've ever had um, at a meet, really, as far as like the electricity and the atmosphere. So it was really, really fun. You lowered your American record over 200 fly today. How does this meet set you up for your goals in the coming season? Um, it sets me up really well. I think um, we've been putting a lot more emphasis on the 200 short course fly the last couple of years just to help me finish the um, 100 fly, but also help me finish the 100 and 200 long course fly. And we're trying to pick up a 200 long course free just to kind of get that fitness going um, for me. I think that's been the missing component is I have speed. I have some underwaters, but um, I want, really wanted to learn how to extend my races. So we putting, we're putting more emphasis on that. So um, the record means I'm in a good spot. Um, I'm really happy with it. It was a fun race. So it was really, really fun. This was the first Jewel in the Pool meet for you. I mean, would you want to be involved again if it returned to America oh, in two years' yeah. time? Oh, yeah, yeah. I think it would be really, really fun. I think we're growing a good uh, core group of guys and girls that um, want to do it. I'm, I'm getting to know more people in the international swimming scene. So it's been more of like a communal environment. I have a Cal teammate or Cal alum teammate of mine, De Demir Duganyik, who was on the Team Europe this time. So it was funny. Like, I have swam countless medley relays with him, but now I'm swimming it against him. So it's kind of a cool atmosphere. Um, just know people and get to know people and just continue to do that. So I'd absolutely love to do that. Okay, well.